Gamer. Welcome back, sports gamers. It's the natural. Very excited today to bring you guys a behind the scenes look at Esports Boxing Club. Make sure you guys drop a like on the video and subscribe for more exclusive content like this from your favorite sports games. All right, let's, and you can really see the details and when they're working through that. So working with his mouse and cursor, he's sculpting some of our greatest fighters back into fighting shape and recreating their appearance from their greatest and most timeless fights. That's pretty much the target. According to SCI, lots of things change with age. Eye shape, lip volume, cheekbones, body fat, cartilage and even ear size he's able to turn back the hands of time on one of the greatest boxers ever step in the ring uh, premissary gathered image references from every angle to plan out what he wishes to achieve he reviews side by side with his current fighter model to understand what to keep and what to airbrush and to stardust based on the images now from there he continues to shape the body next he revises the main muscles and facial features in zbrush to match the classic imagery of Jones Jr. in his prime. And then when he's happy with the result from different angles or perspectives, he begins to work on the textures. Primaciari works on the color map textures in Adobe Photoshop. He adjusts the tones and recreates his hairline and iconic beard. And you know the hairline is one of the first things to go with age. He continues to work on the skin tone to create a young Roy Jones Jr. skin texture and then applies it to the character model. Lastly, the artist adds in details on the arms such as veins and muscle toning in the biceps. SCI is in ultimate production mode, then tests the character model in different gliding environments with the click of a mouse to check the textures and color balances in each unique arena and light setting. And you can see here, it looks really amazing. Steel City Reactive has confirmed with us that ESBC will feature a dynamic fighter damage system. They created custom shaders and blend shapes that allows them to create the appearance of progressive damage as each fight plays out. The shaders update in real time as you play the game to demonstrate damage based on each fighter's health and damage stats. They will actually measure health and damage with each punch and each movement and they use this data to apply the updated visual textures and shaders. The net result is the fighters drip sweat when tired or appear bruised and battered after a long, grueling match. And that'll slowly update as you play the game, as they inflict damage, and as they continue the match. As you can see for the gameplay clip shown in this video, the game looks absolutely amazing. The boxers are lifelike, and the details and lighting and contrast looks as good or better than any sports game we've ever seen. The graphic artists that still see interactive are competing with the best in the world. Primacelli and the company remain on track to establish their footing as a major player in sports gaming. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. What exclusive would you like to see next from SGO and ESBC? I've actually included some gameplay highlights for those who have not seen it previously and are new to the franchise as well. Be sure to drop a like, subscribe for more exclusives just like this from SGO. If you appreciate our content and all the work we do to bring you guys the latest news, tips, and gameplay from your favorite sports games, drop a like to subscribe to SGO today. If you want to take your game to the next level, then join SGO Insider.